This is the new 2019 Wolverine X2 from Yamaha. It takes its design cues from the Wolverine X4 that was introduced in 2018, but is a two-person side-by-side, complete with full doors, dump bed, drive-by-wire throttle, and even reverse lights. The first impressions of the Wolverine X2 by Yamaha are all very positive. It is a fun machine that is actually very similar to the Wolverine X4. And that's the 4C version that came out last year. The chassis is a little bit shorter overall, um, which means that the steering of the Wolverine X2 is a little bit quicker as far as turning radius. Um, it's a little bit more nimble on the trails. Um, and it really is a rec utility vehicle that is focused on the adventure side of that market. This machine has a lot of great features that actually were unveiled with the Wolverine X4. One of the most significant of those features is this 847cc parallel twin engine. It is literally a godsend to this uh, platform and to Yamaha's lineup because it's got great bottom end power, it's got great top end power, it just it's a huge upgrade over the 700 um, engine that was in the previous Wolverine R-Spec and everything. Really, really like the power of this machine. It's very linear. It allows you to climb up any hill that you want. And the beautiful part of it is that Yamaha did a couple tweaks to their Ultramatic transmission. And man, it is even better than before. I love the fact that when you're going up a massive hill, in this Wolverine X2, you can leave it in high, not even worry about it. And it just has all this down low grunt that it's just easy to harness and it's easy to go up any hill that you want. That is definitely one of my favorite features. I think uh, one of my other favorite features about this vehicle is the coverage on the outside. You can be going through some really gnarly mud holes and the mud doesn't sling up. Because it's 59 inches wide and the over fenders are just, just far enough over the tires to where you don't get anything on the inside, you stay dry, you stay clean, life's good, right? It's also really easy to turn the dial for four wheel drive. Um, it engages smoothly precisely and really without any hesitation whether you're going fast slow anything like that um, and Yamaha has always had top-notch fit and finish um, it carries over to this not only in the dump bed but also with the interior as well the interior is very familiar if you've seen the Wolverine X4 it is sort of Yamaha's new design language the center console here, you've got the glove box, um, so between those two, there's lots of storage here for you. Just keeping with the interior, it's really easy with, to handle the gear shifter, your parking brake. It's got the switch cutout so that you can add accessories very easily. Other than that, the interior, the dash is uh, its pretty basic. Um, there's nothing special, but it does give you all of the information that you need in a very clear display. The numbers are um, always easy to read. I do have a couple little gripes with this machine. Um, and one of them is something that I had with the X4. And that's, I'm, I'm six foot three tall. so. I'm, a little taller than your average rider, but at the same time, it's a little compact in this driver's position. Passenger seat is better for sure, but the driver's spot, it's just, it's, it's a little compact. Like my legs, my knees are hitting the side um, in the doors and stuff, and it's, it's not bad, but at the same time, after a full day of riding, um, and if you're my height, you're gonna feel it, you know? Um, the throttle pedal and the brake pedal are at pretty good positions. I wish they were a little bit lower because I'm having to lift my foot up quite a bit. Uh, 
Oh man, this thing is so fun to just push through the trails. Go as fast as you want, super nimble, just handles really well. Um, the fact that you can haul 600 pounds in the back or tow 2,000 pounds with that standard two inch receiver, those are awesome features that we really like. The dump bed, like we said, it's solid, man. It's got tie down points in it. You can haul whatever you want and you can tow stuff too. So this Wolverine X2 really strikes a very ideal balance in the industry for someone that only needs to carry two passengers but wants it to be able to work around the farm and also be able to go on your ultimate adventure. And that's really what it's all about. For more information about the Wolverine X2, check out ATVEscape.com, our ATV Escape mobile apps, or the July-August issue of ATV New TV Escape magazine with a full review, and you can subscribe for free on our website. Thank you so much for watching.